Hello, good morning my fans. How y'all doing? All right, this is my hair twisted up. I talked to y'all, ooh, what's on my face? Mm, briefly Monday about my hair journey. Um, That's the big beautiful window y'all saw. <laughs> I'm always talking about that. I work from home, so I'm not going to turn the camera around and show y'all the other side, although y'all probably can kind of see reflection a little bit through my glasses. So I'm going to turn this way so you can't see the reflection. I just thought I would chime in in the middle of work because when I get off work, I'm going to forget because I'm going to be tired. So I always set the products that are new to me that I've tried and I want to review. I always set it out on the table in the dining room so i remember oh you gotta do a video about that so this is you know the length of my hair if i was to do it like that it that's the shrinkage length if i stretch this mother this mm, then it come down the hill so you know um that's a whole another six inches or so. And if it was straightened, it would be like right here. So, you know. I would love, I'll be glad when my shrinkage grow actually shrinks to my shoulders. Then I will know that my hair is like at least in the middle of my back. But at least my hair is now shoulder length when I straighten it. It's longer than my shoulder. So that's always great. Length retention is great. Um, <laughs> let's get into what I wanted to talk about. Okay. These are my first impressions. What I have to say about the main choice so far, I'm loving the shampoos. Like the, I did the Amazon shampoo, gray slip. Same with this. Cleans, suds, smells good. Great slip. Um, really like this. Very moisturizing. So, okay, main choice. Your shampoos are great. No issues there. Got it on sale, so I could honestly say, yeah. Your mask. <laughs> Let me try to open this right quick. Hold on, I'm about to put the camera down for a minute. I'm still here, y'all. I just want to show y'all right quick how much I've used. <laughs> that much. One use. And this is an eight ounce. So I'm going to probably finesse three more uses out of this, which is great because eight ounces is like, well, wait a minute. If I can get four uses out of an eight ounce mask, then you did your shit. Then it's worth getting your money's worth because my hair is low porosity. So I don't need to apply no more product than needs to be. Now I go a little heavy handed with my leave in conditioners. I realize that that's because look, I want my hair to be moisturized, and this is very moisturized. So, yes, bang for your buck. Yes, will I repurchase? I have another one. And, yes, I would. I like the way this made my hair feel when I rinsed it out, and I really like the smell of it. Gray slip, too. Okay. <laughs> I used a good little bit of this, but, yes, I really like this Tropical Moringa line by Main Choice. I'm impressed so the amazon and the tropical moringa lines first impressions really really great what i don't like is the pearly braid out glaze i tried them i tried the pearly braid out glaze uh, pearly braid out glaze separate from the shampoo from the endless either rinse out or leave in I'm not using no rinse out conditioner from the main choice. You cost a lot. So the fact that I can use this, yeah, you use this my leave-in because you go you cost a lot if I gotta pay a regular price. Uh-uh. I'd rather use a cheaper rinse out conditioner that's still effective. This makes sense to leave this in. Okay. Maybe if I was to use this with the pearly braid eye glaze, it'd be a great whoop de whoop. This is really good and very moisturizing. Maybe it would work better, the pearly bread out glaze. But what I don't like is too tacky, too sticky. And then it gave me flakes. And I was like, okay, I tried it with a liquid leave-in, flaked. Tried it with a thicker leave-in, flaked. I tried it with multiple things. It's just the flakage. Beautiful, gorgeous definition. 
so many flakes to where I was like, I can't. And then my hands was just all stuck together. It was just too sticky. So that's a no. I didn't hate it, but I was like, I'm not repurchasing that. So that was my review. It's a solid collection. If you have not tried the Tropical Moringa, what I would recommend is the shampoo, the hair mask, and the leave-in or the rinse out conditioner those three i would recommend pearly bread i glaze use with caution it's a learning curve and that is it my fams i meant to do this yesterday i used all of those three products that you saw the shampoo the uh leave-in or rinse out conditioner and the hair mask, I used them Wednesday, but I've been working overtime at work. So I said, well, what the hell? At least let me try to squeeze it in today because I will forget. And that's off the top of my head. So yeah, <laughs> you'll see them in an empty next year because I am peeking into everything. I finished my 2020 stash this year. So that's why you're not going to see it in an empty this year year i'm starting to touch my stash that i bought this year and you'll see it in an empty next year and i am going to participate in black friday and i will probably finish that off into 2023 ish so i'm not gonna do a haul for black friday next year as because i may not need to these brands are having sales like crazy all throughout the year so if i do that i ain't gotta participate next year for black friday <laughs> But I am going to participate this year because I have not did a haul in since 2017. I didn't do one in 2018, living with other people that got on my nerves. <laughs> didn't do one in 2019, forgot, and was just getting back on my feet. And I couldn't because I had to work. And last year, I was in the process of moving to from Texas to North Carolina. So those are my reasons why. But now I'm in my own shit. I'm stable. So hell yeah, I'm going to participate. That's why I've been working all this overtime this week. Because I want to buy some shit. So that's it, y'all. Love y'all fans. Bye and thank y'all for y'all support.